Check the mic. <laughs> On September 20th at 3.32 p.m., I knew a power bigger than us had a plan. It was going to either be heartbreak or pure love. Amber, my love. From the first day I met you, I knew you were different. At first, I was concerned that it was because you were out of your mind, when in reality, you were just crazy about me. In all relationships, there are challenges, but we chose love overall. I have never been loved so hard or so well by anyone else. I have come to know you as my home. You are my best friend. We challenge each other, but in the very best ways. I promise you, unconditional love, support, and honesty. I promise to always keep the cupboard stocked with hot chocolate. <laughs> I will always stand up for you and with you. We have been invited here by Amber Gale and Georgia Peterson to witness their covenant with each other. And you all have come to share in this covenant they make today, to offer your love and support, and to allow them to start their married life together, surrounded by the people dearest and most important to them. In the years that they have been together, their love and understanding of each other and of themselves has grown and matured and from this day forward, they will live their lives together as one. best parts of marriage will enrich your already full lives. It helps you build a house where you find rest after a long day and gives you someone to kill the flies. And it is where you find strength to rise in the morning and face the world. The best parts of marriage promise you a partner in pursuing your dreams, a teammate in taking on new challenges, a support in times of struggle. The best parts of marriage help you both become the best of yourselves and the best of what you can be together. The best parts of marriage are the things that sustain you through long days and hard moments. You already know this. You already know that love takes work. You've already taken steps to make the way easier. You've fought out some things, accepted others, and laid a strong foundation for a long and happy life. You've learned to say, I'm sorry, to say, I forgive you, to say, I love you. Amber and Georgia, to each other and in the presence of this assembly, you have made a covenant to join yourselves together as one. You may both kiss your back. Love does not consist in gazing at each other, but in looking outward together in the same direction. When I first met Georgia, she kind of reminded me of Leslie Nope from Parks and Rec. Uh, optimistic, passionate, kind, but most of all, 
uh, ultra crafty. And then something changed. She met Amber, a stoic, handsome person that matched Georgia pound for pound with a haircut that's always on point. She's very compassionate. She loves kids. She's one of the most loyal people I know. She's got a huge heart and uh, she'll share with everyone. Amber is loving, clever, cool, hilarious, strong-willed, kind-hearted, confident, precious, and the very last thing, she's still my little girl. We have found something magical in each other, and you are my greatest adventure. Together, we will get through anything. I love you so much. You, Georgia, are the most beautiful person inside and out. Your heart is so full, and I love you. <laughs>